I asked ChatGPT to name the most unique tomato of the year. And not only did it say it was sorry it couldn't name that for me, it then proceeded to tell me that the notion of a unique tomato is subjective and can vary greatly based on individual taste and regional preferences. So after feeling sufficiently judged by an AI robot, I went to Baker Creek, my favorite website for getting all kinds of wonderful heirloom tomatoes, and they've got an amazing selection. And before long, Gosh, what is that? That is definitely unique. Extraterrestrial looking, actually. So that is a Phil's One tomato. It is described as a mid-season, possibly the wildest, most eye-catching tomato we have ever seen. This according to the Baker Creek description on the package. The semi-determinate regular leaf plants produce extraordinary bumpy glowing yellow globes. Philippe Romans, a tomato breeder from France, pulled characteristics from Ries Tomate, I'm probably butchering all these words, or the Traveler tomato to create this fanciful fusion. Hi green lovers. So while AI might not quite be there, what is here is the single seed challenge. And in today's video, I'm going to be planting my single seed challenge that was started four years ago, this challenge by Scott Head from Black Gumbo Southern Gardening. So this is the fourth year running that I'm participating in this. So I'm really excited about it and really excited about what I'm going to be planting. And you want to stay tuned till the end because I've got a $30 seed gift certificate giveaway from Baker Creek Heirloom Seeds and I absolutely love this company. They do a lot for the community. They do a lot of give back to the world and their mission of finding and preserving the rarest seeds for future generations and for making food sustainable and accessible to everybody is a mission that I think everyone can get on board with. So definitely a big fan and I'm happy to do this giveaway so that you too can stand a chance to try out the wonderful seeds from Baker Creek. Okay, so first let's talk about the single seed challenge. Now, like I said, this is the fourth year, but it was started in 2020 by Scott Head from Black Gumbo Southern Gardening, who runs an absolutely fantastic YouTube channel, so check it out. And basically the idea behind the single seed challenge is that you want to follow the journey of one single seed from its inception all the way through its life cycle and then hopefully to the point where it's producing seeds of its own. It's really a miracle to see a tiny little seed become this plant, produce these fruits and then produce seeds for the next generation. So paying attention to that one single seed in a special way. So most crops, you grow several of them. You don't pay attention to them individually. You kind of treat them as a grouping of plants. But the single seed, because you're planting just one of it, you get to appreciate it deeply. And frankly, over the years, I have learned so much from this single seed challenge. So the first year I did it, I planted Barry's Crazy Cherry. And that seed, um, it was a very, very unique tomato. It created these bunches of almost like grape-like tomatoes. And it was very delicious, very sweet. And that was the first year that I had tomato hornworm infestations. And in fact, Scott Head remarked on my channel that I've got a hornworm when I showed the video of what this creature is. So I learned about this very interesting tomato pest that can take out your entire plant. In 2021, I planted a Chinese five color pepper and that really opened my eyes to the wonderful world of ornamental peppers. And it also introduced me to hot peppers. And I joined this group called Pepper Lovers on Facebook and I was blown away by the varieties, the sizes, the shapes, the colors, the flavors that peppers come in. I had no idea that there was such a vast, vast range of peppers. And I totally fell in love with peppers. And I've been growing so many varieties both last year and I intend to this year as well. 
And then last year, 2022, I grew another ornamental pepper called the jigsaw pepper, a beautiful, beautiful pepper. I totally fell in love with the picture on the package. But what I did not realize was that it was a very small size pepper plant and I grew it in between larger pepper plants and it just did not thrive. It produced a few peppers, but nothing like it looked like on the package. So I was very disappointed with it. I didn't document it very well and yeah, it was in general a total bust. So this year I'm going to do a much better job even if it is not going as well. I'll still document my journey. So I'm going to be creating YouTube shorts and publishing those along the way. And then at the end of the year, I will do a compilation that will bring them all together. Now, what you want to do is every video that you publish, you want to tag it with the hashtag single seed challenge 2023. So everyone participating in this challenge is going to be tagging their single seed challenge that way. So you get to, you know, see the videos that other gardeners are publishing for this single seed challenge and track their journey along the way. So it's kind of a fun social experiment that Scott had put together and you can get to interact with other gardeners as well that are publishing videos on their single seed challenge. It's a lot of fun. Okay, so let's go ahead and choose our seed. Now this package says that it's got a minimum of 10 seeds. But knowing Baker Creek, they usually give you a lot more than the package says. So let's see if that's the case with this one as well. Note that this is a new seed this year, so you won't find too many other videos on YouTube on this particular plant. But let's see how many seeds came through on this. So as you can see, a whole lot more than 10 seeds. There's easily, gosh, 20 seeds here. So yeah, that's Baker Creek for you. Over deliver constantly. And this one is kind of standing out for me. So I am thinking that this one is going to be my single seed challenge right here. That's my single seed challenge. I'm going to pick that one up and I am gently going to be putting it in this. I don't want to spill all my other seeds, so put those back first. I love that their seed packages reseal nicely as well. So I've got my single seed challenge tight here. Looks like there's another one that fell out here, but that's not going to make it. It's going back in the package. So here we go. A kiss for luck. And with that, my single seed challenge is on its way. Okay, so the moment that you've been waiting for, the giveaway. Okay, so let me share with you the rules of the giveaway. It's really, really simple. Number one, like this video. Number two, subscribe to my channel. And number three, throw a comment below on what seed you are most excited about growing this season. All right, but there's more. If you want to be entered into the competition, not once, but five times, what I need you to do is participate in the single seed challenge. Yes, you heard that. Come out of your shell, guys. We got to build this gardening community. And the way that you want to tell me is number one, yeah, you tell me in the comment what seed you're going to be planting for your single seed challenge. And also go to Scott Head's channel. I'll put a link to the video where he is talking about his single seed challenge 2023. And in the comments for that video, you want to tell him that Green Love sent you and that you're going to be participating in the single seed challenge 2023 and tell him what seed you're going to be planting. All right. So if you do that, you'll be entered to win five times. All right. Good luck, everyone. The competition will run through the end of February and I will publish the results sometime between the 1st of March and the 20th of March, which is the first day of spring. So click that notification bell if you want to be notified when I publish the results. Good luck and happy gardening.